Can I speak? I can help you. Yes, hello? Yes. Hi, I was just in there earlier, and I, okay. had, I had gotten one of the uh, Impossible Burgers. Okay. And I, as a vegan, can tell when something isn't completely plant-based. It tastes as if this burger had been cooked next to a real burger. Yeah, it, it is grilled. Okay, on the same surface as a meat-based uh, burger? Yes. Because I can, I can taste the juices. Correct. So it's not it's not it's not vegan or vegetarian option then. Well, the way it works, you're so you got impossible. So that we either put it through the we do it through the boiler, which that's an option, or you're in the microwave. Okay. Well, uh, this this obviously went through the broiler with another burger beside it, and yes. I for the last the, the past two hours have been violently ill, and I've been throwing up nonstop because I could taste. I could taste the juices from the mammal meat. Okay, and when did you come by? Uh, it was about two and a half hours ago, because right away when I got home and I took a bite of it, I could tell, and I've been throwing up nonstop. Okay. Because I, I, okay, I, so, I tasted, the so, fl- you know I tasted I animal get... flesh, and it made me violently ill. Okay, so I can give you a number you can call, um, and you would have to um, call her and let her know what happened. Did you, are you ready for that number? Well, yeah, I'll write it down. Let me get a pen. Because uh, they, they're not okay. going to let me back into the vegan ch- uh, the vegan church. They said that I have to pray to Vishnu for the next 60 days, five times a day. And I, I've got to work. I don't have this type of time to be back in the good graces of the vegan church. Uh, there's a pen. All right, I got the pen. Okay, so you would call, um, you would call, uh, her name is Chris, she's the district manager. Uh-huh. Okay, are you ready? Yeah. Five five nine. Uh huh. Okay, can you repeat that one more time? Okay, and her name is Chris. Yes. Okay. All right. Okay, I, thank I, you. I will call. I'm sorry about that. Thank you. Yes. Thank you. All right. Let's call a let's call a district manager. Hi, is that Chris? This is Chris. Hi, sir. I ordered a uh, Impossible Burger from one of the locations. They said I should call you with my complaint. Okay. What location? Uh, it's the location on North Cedar. Okay. And I was complaining oh. because I had went in uh, and got one of the Impossible Burgers, the, the plant-based burger. Right. And when I got home and I took a bite out of it, I noticed that something was inherently wrong with this. Um, it tasted as if it had been cooked on the same surface uh, that you sear the, the animal flesh burgers. It is cooked on the same surface, but it's not cooked at the same time. There is no meat on the actual plant burger itself. Because Bro- once you put it in, it it it's not... It, there is no. How would I explain it to you? You can't have get meat on it. Well, I'm not. I'm not dumb. You, you, can explain, down, you can explain it normally. No, I know. I know that. I know that. But it's the only way I can actually explain it to you is if I was to show it to you. But oh, there is no way that you can okay, get so any like, when do, meat when on do it. You need me to come down so you can show me. Well, I'm not going to take you in the back of the kitchen, but I'm going to tell you there's no way that you can get meat on it. But, 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 I'm no not way. saying there was meat on it. I'm just saying that the juices of, of the flesh burgers were infused with my burger because they were cooked on the same surface. I'm saying that they're tainted. They're not. They're not. I can tell you. I can assure you that they're not. But the lady, they're not I, cooked the, the girl the I just same. spoke to said it, said and, it was. She said they're both run through the broiler. Yes. And I said at the same time. She said yes. Correct. Not at the same time as the meat. No, you can't because they're cooked at different temperatures. Oh, okay. They're not cooked the same. Well, I'm, I'm just not getting this. Can you all right, explain it to me like I'm a five year old? Okay, we we put the meat through the boiler, which is correct. Uh-huh. But we do not. We cannot cook the plant based burger and your regular Whopper at the same time. They're not cooked at the same temp- the same time. As far as how long they stay in there to cook, okay. Because they're, they're, and they they go into different pans. She said they cannot go the, into the she same said pan. Either it goes through that or it goes through the microwave. Right. 
you you can you can have it cooked in the microwave if you're not going to put any mayonnaise or anything like that on it. Okay, there's, so how, there's there's two how, ways of cooking it. All right, so but how does the burger so come into this? So it depends on what burger, which one, the well, the, the yeah. The plant. You're, you're saying that they're cooked side by side. No, that's not what I said. I'm just I'm saying they're so for example. Our broiler cooks, we can cook eight patties or eight Impossible, uh, which I'm going to call it a burger, even though it's not a burger, not an actual burger, but the plant, the plant one. Mm -hmm. We cook, say, if if I want to cook eight Whoppers or three Whoppers or whatever I want to put down the boiler, we put them on the boiler, we push them into the actual, where they're flame broiled, like if you're cooking outside. We push them in there. We push the time for that burger, and it cooks it for so many minutes. Okay, and so then it. So where does the, where it, does the pan, then it comes where does out, the pan go? Where does the pan, the pan go then? The there's a there's there's different kind of pans that go on the side of the boiler, where the meat actually comes out. So once once they're cooked, it it discards the meat. Oh, okay. So, so, that so after will my go impossible the burger pan. is cooked. Then it goes through a thing and it, it, it like shaves the meat off. So it, it was really a meat burger at one point, and then you got rid of the meat. It was never a meat burger. It was never a meat burger. Well, you said it discards the meat. You, well, I'm saying when I'm cooking the Whopper, the Whopper meat, they're two different things. They're two. They're all cooked the same, but not at the same time, and they don't cook for the same amount of time. Is what I'm saying. Okay, but where where it does has the nothing meat, to do with them the meat having from? meat on it? Well, where does the meat come from? What meat? For the Impossible Burger. Wait, I'm not in, then maybe I'm not a... It's not... It's plant-based. It's not actual meat. Okay, so it goes on the flat-top grill then? No. It still gets cooked in in the broiler. It still gets cooked there. Okay. But it's not actual meat meat. Like, so, so it like, goes... Like, uh, I, I think I'm getting you now. So it goes... In the broiler, and then it gets combined with the meat. No. No. How how would you how how would you figure it gets combined with the well, meat? Well, because then you said there you can no cook meat. up to you can cook up to eight, and then once it comes out, the meat is discarded at different times. At different times, and I'm not saying I'm calling it meat because I'm talking about Whopper meat. I'm not even talking about the Impossible Burger. Uh, how, if how much I put time? the Impossible Burgers down. I, I don't know. I'd have to push look at the thing. I'm not oh, okay. sure. It's so, like so two what you're minutes saying is the burger, the burger goes into the bun, and then it gets microwaved after the broiler. No, it depends on how you ask for it to get cooked. So depending on how how you asking them to cook it, uh-huh. because if you look at the if you look at the menu board, there's yeah. two different ways of cooking it, of making you a, a impossible whopper. Either way, the patty does not contain any kind of meat. Whether you cook it in the mic or warm it up in the mic, or whether you put it through the boiler. But it smells. Either way, it there smells is no. As if it you was can't cooked, it was cooked that. next to a regular meat burger. No, it doesn't. It does not get cooked next to a meat burger. Trust be- me, it be- does not. Because I had to I- go to I had to go to church. I go to a vegan church, and they're very strict. And when I went in there and told them yes. that I ate a burger that was cooked next to a meat burger. They have now shunned me from coming to church for at least three weeks. No, that's, well, I don't know about your church, but I can guarantee you 100% that that Impossible Whopper was not cooked at the same time with that meat at any point. Do they ever get in, come in contact with each other ever? Because, they smell one, the same we understand friend, that if you're vegetarian or you're vegan, that they do not get cooked together. But my friend bought. I can bought, guarantee my you that hundred percent. My friend's a heathen. They bought a regular Whopper, and then I bought the Impossible. And they smell the exact same. Okay, I I don't know how else to explain it to you other than that way, but I guarantee you that they are not cooked together. They are not meat. They're, and you can even tell the difference in a Whopper patty and that Impossible Whopper. I mean that Impossible Burger. You can tell the difference in the patties. They're not, they're not meat. One is not meat. 
The so, Impossible Whopper is not me. I so guarantee you're, you. You're saying the 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 Big Mac is not the same as my Whopper, my Impossible Whopper. I don't know about the Big Mac. I don't know about the Big Mac. I don't. I don't work for McDonald's. I can. I can. I have no idea. Oh, this is McDonald's. Mac is I don't know what's in there. No, this is Burger King. Oh, I went to McDonald's. No, this is Burger King. I don't know what they serve at McDonald's. I don't even know if they even serve an Impossible. You you just told me you ordered an Impossible Whopper, right? No, no, Impossible Big Mac. Oh no, I don't know. I don't know about McDonald's. Yeah, because I went over. We're on I went, Peter and I went Clinton, over, but I went over there I'm to, not. We're not a McDonald's. Yeah, because I went over there to get the McRib because it's back. Oh, I don't know. Does A and W have an Impossible Burger? We do. No, no, I said A and W. Oh, I don't know about A&W. Oh. I have no idea. Who has, who know has better fries, you, you, I, you or Rallies or Checkers? I don't know. I don't eat at Rallies. You don't eat at Rallies? No. Why not? I don't know. What about Chick-fil-A? No. You don't like Chick-fil-A? No, I don't eat at Chick-fil-A. See, I'm a vegan. Chick- I don't eat at Chick- food. Chick-fil-A oh. made me... Like eat, I ate a Chick Fil A. I took a hit last time. Chick Fil A is good. Oh, I don't know. Oh. So did I answer your questions regarding our our Impossible Whopper? Yeah. What That's do you think about In and Out? What about In and Out Burger? Um, I like In and Out. You like In and Out? What you get? A, you get an animal style In and Out? No, no. Uh, I do. Just the regular burger. I, I do the double double. So good. Oh, okay. And then I do animal style because I had a friend tell me that the food is shit if you don't order it animal style. They said you got to order it special, and I'm like, oh, I don't oh, know. I was like, oh, that makes a lot of sense. You got to order it special just so their food's good. Bullshit. Oh, I don't know. And then the whole time when I'm at In and Out, I just go, I just sit there at the table and I go In and Out, In and Out, uh, 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 In and Out, In and Out, uh, 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 like that. Okay, are we done with the conversation? I, I'm certainly not. Are you? Okay, I am. In so I think out, I've answered your question. So I will hang up now. Thank you.